Ministry of Home Affairs has called for a detailed report from West Bengal government on the incident of eight people being burned to death in Bhir Boom district in Bengal after their houses were set on fire. This is being suspected to be a case of retaliatory political violence after a TMC panchayat leader was murdered in a neighboring village. Opposition parties claim that TMC is behind this entire incident, a charge that has been denied by the ruling party in Bengal. Let me go across to our correspondent Tamal Saha joining us on the phone line. Tamal, good morning. Our unexpected lines, in fact, uh, we'll try and reconnect to Tamal Saha uh, in just a bit. But we are talking about a very, very ghastly incident that has taken place in Beer Bhoom district of West Bengal, where eight people were burned to death in their own homes uh, after their houses were set on fire. And this is being suspected to be a case of retaliatory political violence after a TMC panchayat leader was murdered in a neighboring village. Now, opposition parties are claiming that TMC workers are behind this particular incident. However, TMC is denying all these allegations. Meanwhile, the incident has triggered a political war of words too. Bengal Governor Jagdeep Dhankar has condemned the incident, calling it horrifying violence and arson, once again alleging that the state is in a grip of violence culture. CM Mamta Banerjee has hit back, calling his comments highly improper and uncalled for. Our popular leader, he has been killed and later one fire incident happened. And that area, that village, there were no political tension in that village. So we are apprehending of larger conspiracy to disturb TMC and to disturb Bengal. I have emphasized on several occasions that we cannot allow the state to be synonymous with violence culture and lawlessness. The administration is required to rise above partisan interests, which in spite of questions is not being reflected in reality. Let me go across to Tamal Saha now, joining us on the phone line with more updates on this big incident. Uh, Tamal, good morning. Uh, on expected lines, political controversy has broken out in this entire matter, but we on Mira now are focusing on this human tragedy that has unfolded in Beer Bhoom district. We are talking about death, killing of eight people. They were charred to death inside their own homes. What exactly is the status of probe right now? Where is it heading? Any leads so far? Well, so far, 11 people have been arrested and police uh, claim that their investigation is on track. Uh, you know, at this moment in time, the investigating agency, which is the SIT, the state police, they are not really confirming uh, any uh, political angle in that. Uh, but um, they are, they, their uh, uh, initial assessment is that there had been personal enmity and the personal enmity between two individuals had led to this. Uh, well, it all started with the death of uh, the Trinamool Congress Panchayat Pudhan member. Uh, Badu Sheikh, and thereafter, his death had triggered uh, the anger among people, and thus uh, this kind of violence unfolded. That's what the initial assessment is. However, nobody is ruling out the possibility of a larger conspiracy uh, to, in a way, uh, create a situation, and uh, uh, and thereafter, uh, as Mamsa Banerjee claims, that malign the image of the state. But at this point in time, uh, yes, uh, the horrific crime and uh, the, the videos of that, what has now gone viral, has shaken the conscience of people. And uh, uh, the administration is now under a lot of fire. We have seen the state governor questioning Mamta Banerjee. We have seen BJP uh, up in arms against Mamta Banerjee government, demanding her resignation. Uh, because she is the police minister. She is the home minister of the state. We have also seen how this uh, union home minister has also sought a report. But the human tragedy on the ground is very much evident. And uh, there are several layers to it. Uh, we have seen the entire village almost ge getting empty yesterday because there is uh, a fear among people as uh, if, if there would be uh, further fallout uh, of, of this incident. So overall, there is uh, panic among people. And, uh, uh, and, and, and the question is, if everybody has been arrested, then what, what are the identities of these people? And where is the investigation standing at this point in time? 